It's the story of a boy as seen through the camera lens, an image that has become a symbol of a new Palestinian resistance. Fauzi El Junedi surrounded by IDF troops, his blindfolded face tilted towards the sky. Fauzi was detained at Hebron during protests against the US decision to recognize Jerusalem as Israel's capital. Wissam Hashlamoun is the man who captured the moment. The photojournalist had already shot these images before Fauzi appeared in front of his lens. They ganged upon him as if it was a wrestling ring. We only noticed there was a child after they lifted him up from the ground. And that's when we took the photograph and showed it to the world. Fauzi's silent resistance as seen through Wissam Hashlamun's lens has now gone viral. It's been shared thousands of times and held up by world leaders to rally support for the Palestinian cause. Mohammed al Junedi, Fauzi's father, has been unable to work since a workplace injury left him disabled. It meant Fauzi had to grow up fast and start working early. For his grandmother, Fauzi's resistance is a justified act against what she says is Zionist colonization. I am proud that my grandson is one of the fine young men who are brave, strong, and capable of doing everything they are denied. I asked Fauzi's father what he thought of his son becoming a symbol of the latest Palestinian uprising. So how did Fauzi feel, given life in Hebron isn't easy for Palestinians? What were Fauzi's sentiments about living here and about the occupation? Fauzi was denied his childhood, youth and joy by the occupation and the circumstances. He was denied from all his basic children's rights. Your son has become a symbol of the Palestinian resistance and his picture is now being seen and shared all around the world. How significant is that for you? I am proud of having a son like Fozi, who is the talk of all people in the world. I am proud and honored to be his father. May God protect him and bring him back to me safely. Fauzi is still in an Israeli detention center. What is the first thing you want to do or what you want your son to do when he's released, if he's released? I would embrace him. A son is the most precious thing in the world. One should be proud of having such a son. So when I see him, I will hug him with so much emotion. His release from detention would be the best news ever, an indescribable happiness for me as his father and to the whole family, including his siblings and uncles. It would bring us so much pride to say that he was released from prison after being detained by the occupation. Thank you.